of a feather <laughs> star. Where's the, I mean, there are cool rocks. That's another Sacro <laughs> Calyx. Yeah. You can go ahead and zoom in if you like. Adam, what rock are we seeing here? Uh, we're seeing a big hunk of this seamount that fell off. This is a new type of sponge for us, is it not? I think it's the... That's another sacrocalic. Yeah. Oh, it's just on its side. <laughs> it's an interesting position to be in. Hmm. I wonder if there's any stolen ferns. I think there's some uh, corals on top of this rock too. Some whips. Can you zoom on this? Yep. Oh, oh my gosh, yeah, Carbotellinae. All right, go ahead and zoom in. Sacco calyx was the stocked one. Mike, we want to aim a bit lower. A bit lower? Yeah. Okay. For that one right there. Is that Bathypathies? That would be the first one we've seen. Yeah, cool. Looks like we also have some pronoids. Um, some branched, some unbranched. Yeah, that's bathy bathies. That ship move moves. Bleh. That ship move is just completing. I think we're good on that, Mike. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Thanks. Yep. Good. Zoom out. Anything else on this rock star? to look at, Science? Yeah. This one over here. Mm -hmm. Got the time. Yep. All right, Dave, you can go ahead and zoom in. It's a little bit of a Victor Gorgia feel. Yeah. It. If it wants to. Seeing a little more diversity, that's exciting. Well, maybe not Victor Gorgia. No? I might call that Victor Gorgia. I don't know, the color's not quite right. That's Victor Gorgia, yeah. So, Mike, I know it's a comfort level thing, mm -hmm. and you're you're doing great, by the way. But and that's a permanent whip. You want to fly just a little closer. Yep. And yeah, it's doing that. You know. Yeah. You always like you'll drift away from yeah. it um, as right. you're zoomed in. Oh. It's yep. just that, like and makes you want to do that. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's a natural thing, but you also have to remember that you're bringing our light. Uh, with us as well. Yeah. Is that a really small crinoid, stocked crinoid? Over here? Uh, no, this over here. This one there? It has a really small head. Yeah, so then as you as you fly in, you're bringing the light pool in closer. Okay. Science, was there something else on this rock you wanted to look at? Can we zoom on that with the light closer? I just, I the couldn't see the Georgia? color. I'll, I'll, yeah. no, I'll I was just gonna. You drive. I was just gonna tilt your camera down for you. It's it's hard to do both. Yep. I need to fix that. So you can do both without. Okay, I'm seeing the purple drawing. now. Ready for zoom. All right, I'm convinced. We got an ID? Yep, it's Victor Gorgia.
I think we're good here. Keep going up. Yeah. Yep. Okay. <laughs> There's nowhere to go but up. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ready to put in another move? Yes. Bridge oh. nav. Three zero meter is zero six zero. All right, shout out to our friend who is a senior studying computer science. There's no such thing as a dumb question. Um, our friend has a question for the team. So will there ever be a time when we truly have explored the majority of the ocean, such as having mapped a wide majority of the ocean, um, being confident in our knowledge of a majority of the species out there, or is this not feasible? Mm. They kind of have to break that question down. It's a good <laughs> question. So <clears throat> in terms of mapping the majority of the ocean, there's an effort underway called Seabed 2030 that has mm. set the ambitious goal to map the entirety of the ocean by 2030. Oh, wow. Um, it's really going to be a challenge not so much in these deeper parts, but in the shallower parts where it, the amount of ground you can cover with a, with a multi-beam sonar gets smaller and smaller. Um, but yeah, I think in, in the next decade or so, we should have that pretty under control. And then in terms of the, you know, knowing all the species out there, probably not, uh, in our lifetime, you know, it's right. it's uh, the amount of ground that we cover here is infinitesimally infinitesimally small, um, and we're really focused on things that we can see visually. You know, there's right. all sorts wow, of little yeah. microbes <laughs> and what that we Spicy. can't see. So <clears throat> that's going to be a long-term endeavor, I think. Yep. Yeah, is the Seabed 2030 uh, goal to cover UCC, ECC? US uh, EEZ? No, oh, it's yeah. international. International oh, yeah. approach? Wow, that's impressive. Yeah, no. No. Rats. <laughs> I was going to say, if you're going to make a zoom out on this, you just, Mike's um, just leveled thanks up. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for exploring <laughs> with us. Straight into clip all <laughs> zooms. Uh, um, that might be a coral. It's like it. What, this one? Yeah. Yep. You want to look at it? Yeah. Okay. Looks like right along the top edge of this is a yeah. interesting there's spot. Another big big yeah. Cool. Looks like another primnoid. Yeah. So beautiful. Okay, got it. Yep. Where is the other uh, item you want to look at? That's a big Victor Gorgia. Okay. Oh, so not the Victor Gorgia. Well, yep. the Victor Gorgia, but I think if we can skirt along the yeah, edge of this, way. there's yep. there's more stuff. Yeah, I'd like to see the um, overhang or under the overhang. Under the overhang. Under Ooh, the. That's a that's a <laughs> rough you know I mean? request for a <laughs> ROV. You want to look under the overhang? <laughs> um, Just keep going along. The along edge. the overhang. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's another primnoid. Purple primnoid or Victor? Uh, Victor Gorgia down Perfect. there, and then this one looks like another prim. Actually, can we zoom on this, please? Yep. 
That's looking a little more like Plexorid or Paragorgia. Squat lobster. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Dave, ready for zoom? Always ready for he zoom. He lives for it. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and zoom in. I do. Looks like Paragorgia to me. Yeah, I think I think so. Great. That's good. Thank you. Sure. And zoom back out. And where else were you guys looking at? Looks uh, like there's more out of the. Okay. Looks like an Anthemastus right there. Yeah. <laughs> the ship's finishing a move, so we can check out more of this little edge if we want. Cool. Looks like another Bathypathies. More from Noids. Okay. Dave, ready for zoom? Yep. Okay, go ahead. It's more if you were That's ready for That's Morella <laughs> and yeah. Victor so Gorgia. You can just say zoom in. if we get closer. Right. Looks like there might be another um, black coral over here. Okay. You guys don't want to zoom in on this? No. No, that's okay. Yep. That's another bathy bathy. Yeah. Oh, okay. Probably cute. There it goes. This really is an overhang. Mm -hmm. Is that a Chrysogorgia? Yeah. It's got a lot right here. And a sponge over there. Is this an eDNA sample spot? Yeah. Yeah, why not? You guys ready for that? Sure. What are we doing? Uh, I want to take a water sample. Okay. So okay. you can just go. Auto on auto. Okay. And then you don't need to touch anything. Hopefully. <laughs> 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 the autos are autoing. <laughs> so the chat just wrote in that someone who just saw the interaction at the Parley station at the Bishop Museum. So, Daniel, shout out to you. <laughs> Thanks Bye. for tuning in. Oh, is it updated? Oh, yeah. I just updated it. Yeah, yeah, oh. yeah. I see it. Oh, you're the updater. Negative. I used to manage the website, Welcome so I Mike. still have access, but uh, communications lead is the updater. But you have the power. <laughs> I mean, I've got the power. <laughs> That's Can a we huge hot What? Big critter. 
<laughs> Might call for Zoom. Yep. Good. Zoom there, Dave. <laughs> for all of our new Dave viewers, Zoom. we have a new team member Gosh, on the East to watch. We have Mike Burns, thing. Atalanta pilot. Currently Wait, starring in the Herc munching. Roll. It's munching? Yeah. <laughs> what? On sand. So Same sediment. boy. It's not like oh, 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 completely oh, oh, clear like a lot what? of things I've seen. I well, <laughs> am very impressed with that. <laughs> oh, oh, it's oh, almost yeah, round. <laughs> oh, he wants belly rubs. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Extrusion. <laughs> oh. Okay. That, uh, wow, oh. that is has anyone ever seen one that big? Yeah. No, I have <laughs> not. That's impressive. <laughs> oh. Doesn't even look like, oh. <laughs> Is that a reaction to our presence? It's currently proceeding. Yeah. Right, everyone, grow <laughs> up. It's not you, Mike. <laughs> okay, Andy. This some highlight. documentation. Highlight, highlight, I got it. I got oh, my God. Oh. actually do have um, a highlight on the Nautilus Live channel that's called um, <laughs> something like Sea Pig Expulsions, and it's <laughs> kind of a highlight reel of all of these moments. But. What? <laughs> Look at that. Oh my goodness. And Dang. forwards. Dang. And back. So graceful. <laughs> yeah. Right? Oh, my back. <laughs> It's just so chubby, right? Wow. <laughs> the ship has stopped, so we can <laughs> okay. appreciate Good. the future thank you, for thank as long you. as we need. <laughs> it is, I am totally appreciating I just want to take this all in. <laughs> Embrace the presence. <laughs> Just like the Holotherian took in all of that sediment. <laughs> <laughs> and back out as well. Connor is sharing with us that he will do that when it gets spooked and to be able to make itself lighter. Ah. Oh. So, it can just oh. away. so it's a rapid ballast drop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it seemed to be moving very quickly. You're like, okay, that's enough. I'm going to go back <laughs> down here. All right, come back out. You guys are ready to keep going? That is something that happens, though, is that, uh, you know, the, these things are not moving very much generally, and when you disturb them and they have to run around, they, they tire out pretty quickly. Yeah. And that's mm. sort of a technique you can use to collect them. So you, mm. you just follow them and they wear them down and... That's well, just a really <laughs> massive sea cucumber. Like, there's one to the left of it that looks like a normal size. Right. Okay, well, that was invigorating. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you got to come over. Yeah, if you want to come over yep. starboard, that would be ideal. <clears throat> and then we'll put in another move. Actually, it looks better if Atalanta stays over there. <laughs> well, it looks better. Oh, no, I'm just saying that it keeps bouncing around, but oh. when it's over here, alignment is better. You Everything's fine. Oh, glass Actually? sponge. A little bugle there. Bugle sponge or something. Do you want to zoom on that? Yeah, let me get a position. Good. Uh, good zoom in. Oh, that's one of Fancy. the ones that we saw yesterday. Ooh, yeah, I don't remember the name of the this. Puppy Cheeto one. Here we go. That one. 
uh, Corbitellinae. Ah, yes. Common name, Puppy Cheeto one. <laughs> yeah. Reminds me of Sarah and her cat and the hot Cheetos. I don't think I'm familiar with that. Her, her cat <laughs> likes hot Cheetos. The cat doesn't eat hot Cheetos, does it? Uh, it does. Oh, oh my. Uh, Mike, I'm going to reset our DVL, which means you'll just not see the Herc icon for a moment. Okay. If that's okay. And now it's back. We can keep moving. Keep moving? Yeah. Ready to move? Yeah. Bridge now. Move. Uh, three zero meters, zero six zero. Oh, chat is asking, is it possible that Holothorian was Prager's? Oh. Uh, <laughs> I, don't, I don't think uh, <laughs> mm -mm. that's how they reproduce. But it is a good question. Yeah, that is how do out. they reproduce? How do, right. Um, I will have to look into that, but I believe... Uh, spawning, releasing mm. gametes okay. into the water column. Yeah, I mean, everyone else in the echinoderm family does. I imagine it's the same. I wonder if they're hermaphroditic. Hmm. Oh! So Asexual goes. reproduction in adult holothurians occurs as transverse fission and fragmentation. Oh, wow. That is really? not what I expected. Oh. <laughs> so they bud off little holothurians? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, and broadcast spawning. Okay. Uh. <laughs> <I was laughs> like so both of those things, but that's yeah, not something I expected. Right. All right. You ain't getting hard. Just wait for the ship. I love when people yeah. ask questions and then I learn something new. Move is coming up to speed. Oh, thank you so much, chat. Um, no problem. Thanks for sticking with us. Um, you folks are awesome. If you have any more questions, send them in. Our team is happy to answer them. Yeah. Hey, Mike, is this your first time um, driving Herc? This is my first time driving Yes, Herc. Chad's oh. saying you are doing a good job. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, chat. <laughs> Is that a another uh, psychophalix? Yeah, don't don't move anymore. Uh, psycho calyx. Wait, psycho calyx. Yep. <laughs> If it'd be like, this there. counts as a boulder of life for us on this yeah, side. Very high biodiversity there. in this area. Down off to the right. Oof, bit yeah. of a hot spot. We have a sponge and an uh, astro schema. I guess there's a couple of them on that rock. Brittle star. Bits. 
I don't think you said the right phrase. We're about. No. Oh. Dave, do you want to zoom? <laughs> yeah. yeah that, Dave, yeah, you want to zoom? <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's a dead something. That's a lot of that's something. Quite living. Wow. No, down the down oh. to the right, the stock. Can we look at okay. the associates? They seem very active. Yeah. Interesting. Does it make cute? <laughs> 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 A gamut of appearance. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's going on there. All right. That's good. Thank Carry you. Carry on. Okay. I keep the ship moving. Bridge nav. Yeah. That is a big hunk of seamount right there. Mm, well, three zero meter is zero six zero. It's interesting at the end of it, kind of looked like columnar jointing mm. going that way. Yeah, it's probably the most interesting feature we've seen is so far. Venus is that the Venus? Oh, yeah, it is. A big one. I haven't seen one of those yes. in a while. I'm so happy to see one. Yeah? <laughs> been it's waiting. been a second. Is that a tri-flap? Yeah, it's a tri-flap. <laughs> I've never seen one. <laughs> oh. With the, whoa. Um, what is look whoa. at that. That's what? different. That's beautiful. These are the ones we normally see the, with the kind of speckled That's bumpy exterior. Really? Look, That's look not what we've here. seen on... Not on, sorry, not on this cruise, but... Uh, yeah, it's speckled. Hmm. Uh -huh. yeah. Very interesting. I'm wondering why it looks like that. We haven't seen... I love the purple crinoids. Oh, yeah. Wow. I want to see one swim. Oh, yeah. That would be interesting. Have you ever seen it? No. Yeah. It's really cool. They're one of my favorite animals, I think. Really? Yeah. Hmm. You what? haven't mentioned them. Oh, the, the, you talk about, about the Venus flytrap, yeah. yeah. No, the crinoid. Oh. They're listening. Other stars. <laughs> what are they <gasps> associated to? Ooh. Like a dead? Oh, uh, wow. It's a dead. I'm guessing bamboo. I think that might be a sponge star. There's some there. zoanthids and hydroids. Uh, unidentified stock. <laughs> oh, nice. Nice shot. So the crinoid can just detach itself and you guys are swim away. It's got away. these tiny little legs on the bottom what? that are all wrapped so. around the okay. stock. Yeah. Uh, Did you find the video? Of the swimming? Of a move. Here, I'll show you on my laptop. Mark, that was some nice flying right there. Thank you. That really was. Yeah, yeah this is, yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh <laughs> let's go. <laughs> let's go. I got it. Yes. Yeah, so instead of let's instead go. of saying like let's go, it's let's go like L E S S S G G. Let's go. Oh, 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 nice. whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah. Okay. Here it is, Andy. Oh, what? It's not neat. That is beautiful. Well, we can see over it. Sponge there. Yeah, yeah, they're really cool. What? You're looking Look at something else, right? That's oh is. yeah, we're looking at a video. <laughs>
So we have all these skin bottles available. Can you push that? Yep. It retract? Yep. Okay. Retracting. That star could and be. Then nope. Pan over to the other side as you go. Okay. Panning over. And which one are we doing? Any one of them. They're all open. Nepanthia? I don't know. Go to main We're going page. for number six. This would be sample one, two, two. Uh, one, two, two, Roger. I made this crazy thing. <laughs> <laughs> Adam, what is her um, altitude from the bottom? Uh, I'm by. trying to see it here. but 4.8 meters. Okay, thank you. That doesn't work. Now it's 5.0 meters. <laughs> no problem. What is it now? Thanks, Samantha. 5.2. Okay. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, you're watching? Yep. Watching. Yep. It happened. Some. Uh, Jules, can you give me a brief description of what we're seeing here in terms of biodiversity? Yeah. Um, we're primarily there seeing okay. primnoids. There's also um, Isodella, the um, unbranched bamboo coral. There's a chrysogorgid, uh, crinoids, some ophiroids, a sea star. Go ahead and extend. Yeah. Thank you. And I think, um, I think that sea star is Ripidaster. Auto accent, auto. I can send you the spelling because it's a little weird. <laughs> yes, please. Okay. It's really beautiful, that one. <laughs> Chat, we are not inside Hercules. <laughs> we have our, <laughs> our team is in the control van on Man, the ship. Man, I wish. Controlling. <laughs> Can we look at we that have yellow thing, pilots, please? Um, what? Yellow thing. Atalanta and Big Herc. But our team is on the ship in the control van. Aloha, Daniel. Good to have you with us. I shouted him out. Oh, okay. Cute. <laughs> Go and zoom in, Dave. Is that an echinoid? Urchin King? Confirm? Yep, that's one of mine. <laughs> <laughs> Took me a minute. <laughs> yep. I hear you. Yeah, the starfish rides at midnight. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. Half hour left for the watch. It'll be the longest half hour of your life. <laughs> I <laughs> <laughs> There's some stiff competition. <laughs> Other hours. What, the last this. watch? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Choose um, any tearing. day of the last. Kay. You guys good here? 20 yeah, days. we're good. Kay. Are we on to our third week? I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah. You're not sure? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah, we're going on our third <laughs> week in, on Tuesday. <laughs> I don't think he needed this sticker. That was <laughs> really impressive. Are you sure you haven't driven an ROV before? Ever? Driven an ROV. Nope. Lots of video games? Uh, yes. Okay. Clearly. <laughs> 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 Clearly. Because that, yeah. Robert doesn't hand out uh, effusive compliments like that. <laughs> well, thank you guys. I appreciate it. You even got a uh, potentially viral highlight out of that Holotherian <laughs> encounter. <laughs> Obese Holotherian. Okay, we're on yeah, going. Well. Nope, no move yet. Ready? Yeah. Bridge now. Um, Paula, I have an ID for the urchin. I'm not even going to attempt to say it. I'll send it in the chat. <laughs> Sounds good. Three Thank zero you. meters, zero six zero. Hey, 
zoom in, Dave. Pathy pathies. Yep. All right. Hmm. It's looking a little tattered. Mm -hmm. What are those? And they be stolen a friends. There? Like the base of that little. Oh, we have a sea pig in the water column. Yes, we do. You zoom, Dave? Hmm. Dirt. Dirt? Mm, something. Can you zoom in on the, the vertical? Vertical? Yeah. Which vertical? Like right, right Where your here. lasers are, you're there. This could be little baby corals. A oh, wall. Wow. I don't know, actually. Maybe. Uh, Maybe not. Yeah, that's what I would guess. Hydroids. All right. Okay. Thank you. We do have a, a question about the spatial distribution of the primoids. Um, is there a reason why all of the primoids are in such a random spots and so far from each other? Um, well, corals, corals reproduce asexually and um, sexually by spawning. So corals will release gametes into the water column. Some corals are hermaphroditic, so they have both male and female um, gametes. Oh, it looks pathies. like a black. Yeah. Um, yeah, and so the egg is fertilized in the water column, and then it will float until it lands somewhere. And if it's a good enough spot, it'll survive and grow and form a colony. Um, so that is one way that um, that corals good. can end up in good. new places. The larvae good. is carried in a current. And then I guess it also comes down to um, the environment, like how suitable it is. Right. Someone cleaned off that rock. Look at that shiny bit there. Oh. What does that mean? Someone was grazing. Starboard. Por favor. Starboard eye. Oh, look at that big candy corn right there. I was there. looking at that, and I thought you <laughs> might like it. rock, we've got half an hour, so <laughs> that's what That's an awfully big candy corn. I know, it's too big. But I do like these ones where you can kind of tell where the pieces came from. Yeah. So well, let's keep exploring, but we might pick something out for the next watch to pick up. Bridge now. Have you ever 
uh, come across an organism that has like a visible disease on it? We've come across things that have parasites for oh, sure. Okay. Okay. Um, we see a, disease. We saw a fish with like a isopod riding right, on top of right, it. Right, right. Yeah. We did. get a pretty weird perspective from just looking at Hercules. I need to look up at Atalanta every once in a while yeah. to kind of figure out. <laughs> Orient yourself. like a primnoid based yeah, on the polyps. Is that a fish? That's what I've been wondering. Something. Is I think that's. Sand over there? This I think it's a rock. That's a rock. It's a rock. Um, what is this though? Is that a crinoid? Can you zoom in, Dave. Yeah. Yeah, it's a crinoid. Okay. Thank you. Tilly. Oh, is it? Yeah, you're right. Is it? Is he oh, pig? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, and then we have a fish question. So, um, this viewer has been watching and we, we have seen two fish. With the distance between them and in the complete darkness, they are curious, how do they find each other to procreate? A meet cute. <laughs> meet cute. Meet cute. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's a good question. That's a great question. Um, I don't know much about deep sea fish, if I'm being honest with you. But I would think that we're only seeing a fraction of these fish, and so there are certainly more in the area right. that are hiding from us. You're saying um, there's more fish in the sea? I'm <laughs> saying there's more fish in the sea. <laughs> yeah. I think some use uh, light as mating cues. Oh, oh like okay. Different patterns. <sighs> That's as far as my knowledge goes. They have ways of communicating that um, 
are different from the ways that we communicate. And that's about as much as I can say about that. <laughs> yep, so no <laughs> Snapchat for the kids. No Snapchat. Got it. Not an iPhone in sight. No apps. Just vibes. <laughs> 20 Ooh. minutes left for this watch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, any rocks? <laughs> Not those, no, thank you. <laughs> okay, let's do another move. Bridge nav. I really want to see one of those worms. Oh, I, there, that was really cool. I, I hope see we see a worm. one. Let's see so these patterns on the seafloor. Bridge, no? Three zero meters, zero six zero. There's a little fish, a fish. Third sighting, let's go. Zoom in, Dave. Is it a cuskiel? No, mm. oh, rat tail. Bridge, no. Hard to say go. from right here. Rat tail. I'm just going to change the bearing. Let's do a th three zero meter zero six five. Ooh, spicy. That was different. <laughs> oh my gosh. What is fish that? Central. Another fish. Is that a halosaur? Yeah. I think, so. is I this, think a this is a rat tail. Oh. So not a meat cute. <laughs> um, I don't know. <laughs> Cuskiel, according to I Connor. don't know. It's hard Connor's to say. A, Connor's wrecked our uh, Actually, I think that's fish a Cuskiel. Cuskiel. Yeah. Cuskiel. Halosaur. I'm going to capture this in the still cam. Cool shot. They're meat cute. <laughs> oh, I don't have still cam up here. Anymore. Are you getting it? Get it again. Um, hold on. Yeah, the halosaur is a little bit cropped out. That's okay. I I don't have that view up here anymore. Oh, that's fine. If you hit the fourth purple button, you'll Give get a it. little more. The juice. unmarked purple button. That should have done. Wow, that's do a cool it. shot. I yeah, don't know. These are pretty What's cool. <laughs> uh, things are happening. It's great. Dan, I'm what's getting some good pictures. We're good. It? We're good. We got it. Okay. Ship move, picking up. Allosaur. Yeah, that salvo doesn't work from my panel anymore either. That worked Dang fine it. this afternoon. Oh, great shots of the halosaur too. Awesome. Sure, funny looking. <laughs> So if you could be a deep sea organism, which one would you be? Oh. Um. <laughs> Fail at TT. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Did I pronounce it correctly? Yeah, yeah. Sweet, okay. <laughs> I think I'd be a just a big old holothurian <laughs> munching through the sediment. You betrayed the sea urchins. <laughs> <laughs> no longer the king. Oh, no. My people. Groaned. It's a coup. 
<laughs> I think I'll be a China cops. Yeah. Nice. I nice. like that one. Baby China cops or adult <coughs> China cops? Baby China cops. <laughs> Permanently baby China cops. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if we're really going to be honest, I don't want to be a deep sea creature. <laughs> True. <laughs> enjoy it. That's a good point. Zoom in, Dave. Looks like a from now on. Yeah. Uh, on branch, Prim Noy? Mm -hmm. That's good. good. Thank you. Good. It's so red. It's crazy. <laughs> Bridge nav. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> Bless. <laughs> we can add a uh, three Going zero meters blessed. to zero six five. Um, I think maybe I'd want to be something that like floats around, just like sort of encounters food as it moves around, but it's not really like like moving anywhere like on purpose. You like know? a Marco Medusa? <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. You'd yeah. like to be a Lagrangian particle. I think I'd just like to be floating. That would be a good lifestyle. No just thoughts. Just going with the flow. Yeah. Any thoughts from our front row? <laughs> what are we thinking about? What deep sea animal you'd want to be? Uh, I don't want to be a deep sea animal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with you, man. Never mind. That was very straightforward. <laughs> <laughs> I already contributed. I'm a little squid. <laughs> oh, maybe a cephalopod. They don't live that long, though. Actually, do deep sea cephalopods live longer? Uh, be a green shark. Greenland shark. That's oh, a wow. Greenland shark. That's what I would be. To the question of octopus lifespans, no. Um, you say no? One to three years. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, yeah. There, but there was a um, a deep sea octopus. Uh, I'm blanking on the name of it right now, but. Um, the Mbari, Monterey Bay Aquarium Research Institute, uh, went back to the same site four years in a row and saw the same octopus rooting a clutch of eggs there. Wow. That is exciting. So you get four to live four yeah. years, but you got to brood um, eggs the whole time. Also, yeah. <laughs> and they don't okay, so I, that yeah. number was inaccurate. It's that actually 16 to 18 years. Oh, oh there we go. That's not bad. Yeah. I think you have to choose between life quality or life expectancy. Like if you want to move around and have like fun mm. on the water column. <laughs> you just going to have fun. Down. Really <laughs> philosophical. <laughs> if you're trying to dodge the water column, That's the bigger organisms. Yeah. You know what I mean? No. If you're like a, like a jelly, you're trying to yeah. dodge all the bigger animals yeah. in the water column. If you want to yeah. live a long time, you're gonna be one of these corals. Yeah. Oh, true. Yeah. You can't move. That's true. Think. Can't they can't move. move yeah. Aren't there jellyfish that are like nearly like they live forever? Oh like yeah. Well, that they, they kind of like clone themselves. They clone themselves yeah. forever. Yeah. Well, but Greenland sharks live forever, right? Well, they live a very long time. A couple hundred years. Yeah. Right? Why do you want to be a Greenland shark? I mean, because it's a shark. <laughs> Fair enough. Hey, well, but why a Greenland shark? Because it's a deep sea shark. Um, you asked for deep that's sea a critter. <laughs> <laughs> not a cookie cutter? No, not, uh, not a cookie cutter. 500 years. Whoa. Wait, what? That's a Greenland yeah. shark? Sharks have that's seen some too things. old. Oh, that's no. too old. That's not old. That's enough. too many years. That's incredible. <laughs> wow. 
Okay, Dave. Your what turn. What kind of uh, deep sea animal are you? <laughs> no or way you a mega to mouth shark yeah, is just, real. Yeah, uh, just kind of with Bob. I don't want to be a deep sea animal. <laughs> okay. Okay. It sounds it's dark and cold. Yeah. Dark, cold. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. But say no you had to, to be. Yeah, it's like, you had to. It's like Alaska in the wintertime. Yeah. Had enough of that. <laughs> I'm surprised nobody said Dumbo Octopus. Chad says Dumbo Octopus. It's a good one. Nice. Oh, That's usually yeah. my answer like for everything. Is, yeah. Is yeah. yeah. There it is, Dave. So. Yeah. yeah. We'll take that. Grimpatuthus. We'll Grimpatuthus. Can never go wrong with that one. Which is super weird when I asked how he how he slept last night. <laughs> it's like Dumbo Grimpatuthus. Octopus. <laughs> <laughs> what? Pathy <laughs> pathies. So we had a little band of lots of life, and it was on, you know, sheer walls and big right. boulders. You right. Now we're getting mm -hmm. ba back into a slim pickings. Slim pickings. I thought you said there were plenty of fish in the sea. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're just. Like just missing it. All the action's like right up there. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> perfect change. for the next watch. No, let's change course. <laughs> oh, look at you that. You want to do that? The promise. We line. don't have to go to waypoint two. <laughs> I think if we, we keep going on this course, we we'll hit, we'll hit more steep stuff. Okay. I'm gonna put in one more step then. Bridge nav. Oh, Connor gave us more information on the immortal jellyfish. It's a hydrosoan. Oh. That's a great shot of Herc from Atalanta. That's awesome. I revert to its Medusa life stage. That's pretty neat. Bridge, no? I think the bridge has given up on us. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Two zero meters of the Is it? Wait, what? Zero. Yeah! Where? Another chunky one! Or oh, it? nice! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh. Should I, I just cancel that, that shipment? That's why we haven't <laughs> seen anything. <laughs> it's eaten everything in the area. Zoom in, Dave. I'm afraid wow. of what we're seeing. Oh. Yeah. It looks so healthy. Wow. <laughs> it's practically oh. glowing. Looks like a, right? a brain, like, like, so gorgeous. Wow. Really run the gamut on the uh, comments <laughs> here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. oh no. <laughs> <laughs> too close, too close. It's kind of, close. <laughs> it's kind of it looks like it's okay. Uh, <laughs> getting ready for takeoff. <laughs> Extrusion. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> or expulsion. <laughs> expulsion. <laughs> Can't put the toothpaste back in the tube, as they say. Oh, we're um, all wow. children with five <laughs> minutes left in the watch. <laughs> <laughs> I am really happy the close-up was over I got the other some side. Yeah. Great action wow, I'm shots. so happy we got to see another one. It was too close. <laughs> <laughs> I have the giggles. Jeez, where's our relief, man? <laughs> Oh my god, what a great <laughs> I know, wow. I love that seal cap. Oh my god. It's beautiful. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get another one? Yeah, I, I got the whole oh. Oh. Wow. <laughs> situation. <laughs> Annie, was that tagged as a highlight? 
<laughs> yeah, oh, okay. you, you already know. <laughs> I like That's like a five rating. I like this one too. It's really gearing up. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, it's gearing up right there. Just <laughs> this is such a beautiful Preparing photo. Preparing for takeoff. Whee! What is happening here? No. Oh, look at those patterns. Is, are those? That's the worm, right? Uh, uh, I think that's actually it? like downslope transport, oh, okay. just kind of stuff sliding downhill. Fish. 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 <laughs> That there's a track. Right. Holothurian. Hmm. Oh, is that a hydroid? Um. Can we zoom on that? Thank you. <coughs> the ship's stopping in five meters. <laughs> <laughs> Percentage? Oh, a sea star? Yeah, I think it's a percentage. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Samantha, did our average improve? That's a big negative, Annie. Okay. <laughs> uh, we wow. did average two cucumbers, though. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was we something. did. Okay. Oh, Made up for it in cucumbers. All right, chat. Uh, 8 to 12 signing out. 12 to 4 the ship signing has stopped, in. You by guys the way. have been amazing. Stay tuned.
はい Amber, the temperature's all good, right? Okay, good. Now, just a little paranoid. Mm -hmm. Yes, oh, yeah. we are looking at it. There was a small spike, uh, okay. but it is coming down. Okay, great. Um, all right, well, looks, the like, third. Uh, looks like we're all settling in. And as we are, I'm just gonna introduce... Uh, Michael. Yes, Leela. Hello. Hello. Um, I think that, oh, well now I looked up and I think we're in a different place. If we haven't gone too far, there was like a, a, a kind of like broken rock patch. Yeah, that's probably it. And uh, some rocks hanging out below it. Are we in a spot? Are we, is the ship holding? Yeah, right? Yeah, we're stopped. Okay. Um, wherever we were when we walked away, or when, when the last watch walked away, yeah, here. We want to collect a rock, is where what I'm getting at. <laughs> Something that looks like it's fallen off of the flow right here. Something that's laying below it. Looks like it was part of it. Okay. Yeah, right. I know this all looks fairly steep, but if there's a spot. Yeah, we might be able to still get up against it. Do you see anything offhand? Um, I gotta come up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, uh, sure. I'm Position yourself Atlanta. wherever you like. We'll see what there is. It was in this section, you think? Yeah. Uh, oh, I don't know if there's anything over there. If that's a place you can sit. Oh, you're saying yeah, sit right up, up here? here? Yeah. Not up there. Something where we can kind of tell where the rock has tumbled from, like it's below a bigger rock feature. Right, right. Let's just see. lights. I don't know, maybe something over there. Take a sniff. I haven't had any luck the la all, all last night. Every one we went for was attached. Really? Yeah. yeah. There was one Every with like the two one little finger holes. That was a, yeah. a yeah. main rock. The only reason I think we went with it such bad Because we can actually grab it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> uh, yeah, come down a bit. You can give me five meters there. Yeah. What about that? The yeah. D -d 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 uh, this one know. I'm trying to put in the middle here. Like under the the one to the left of the lasers right there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that looks good. Is loose, come up. It has to be. Yes. 
Hmm. That one looks all altered. Want to try a different one? Yeah. How about this one? So hard for me to, yeah, I don't know, you know. Adam, why'd you leave us? <laughs> we really haven't found any that are not altered yet. Kind of crusty. Uh, maybe let's look a little more, look around a bit more. See if there's anything that's like. I think this is all going to be like attached stuff. Really below a feature. Oh, like pick like up one of the flows. Yeah. Right. Something that's below one of those larger flows. I don't know that we're going to find anything much better than that, but I'm, we could try. Maybe look, yeah, near that flow on the right. What was that, Sarah? Some really puffy sea cucumbers. Oh yeah, they've seeing. been seeing these absolutely ginormous yeah. sea cucumbers apparently. Chunky. Very yes. girthy. Yeah. Oh. Yep, so this is the 12 to 4 watch checking in. I'm your SPL host, Daniel. You want to go around and introduce ourselves? Let's uh, wait quick when we're done with this rock sample. Zoom on this. Yeah. I think we're gonna see a lot of them. I was gonna say. Pass. <laughs> <laughs> they got a really good still cam picture. Yeah, they it. did. It was incredible. Uh, still man, that. For rocks. I guess. Yeah. I guess maybe if there's something below this. Somewhere you'd feel good setting up. These these ones that are coming right under the lasers now. Yeah, I think those would good. be okay. That one looks good. This one, uh, that one, that one right there. Yeah. And if not that, then one of those over there. Um, would you like this one? Or the uh, one let's right? look at that one. The little one. Okay, okay, fine. The one you, the one you were motioning to. It looked so big, though, from my yeah, perspective. That, that one is big, but uh, yeah, this is a decent size. Poly key. Let's look at it. Hey. Hmm. Hey. I don't. It looks like move. it's moving. It's moving. Yeah. What's going on here? It must be large. Really s 
sedimented, yeah. Could also look at like that one. It's gotta be really dug in there, huh? Yeah, out. That must be deep. It's like a tooth that's got to come out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, you got another one? Yeah, yeah, one of these ones on the left would be okay, too. Like, maybe that one. flat. They need to be extracted. Yeah. <laughs> Avalanche. <laughs> that one looks huge and flat. Okay, let's not do that one. That's a <laughs> one oh no. We'll never be able to see again. I don't know. It'll only be a minute. Um, what about like... There were more on the left. Oh yeah, let's look at... Uh, like, is that one an individual rock? Just keeping an eye inside that 20 meter mark. Yeah. You can, uh, all right, for the moment. Yeah. What, did that just break? Yeah, it's just this kind of stuff. You don't want that, do you? And that one looks more altered. <laughs> Picking rocks is hard in this area, y'all. <laughs> Adam really left us. He really did. He's, <laughs> <laughs> he's like, oh yeah. Whatever. Yeah, just pick one. Just pick any anything over here is good. <laughs> um, <laughs> anything if we pan a little to the left. Seems like there were some angular ones over there earlier. Just hop up and move over there. Okay. I wonder if these ones that are buried are more altered. Had like diagenic oxi oxidation or something. What does it mean when a rock is like altered? When you see the uh like the f the ferromanganese oxidation. Mm. At least that's my understanding. Daniel, feel free to correct me. It's not like the original basalt rock inside a lot of it anymore. Okay. Which is what Adam really needs for dating. All right, I don't know. Look at that. There's a little that. jelly going by. Have these rocks kind of just been crumbling this whole time? Been what? Or has it just been really silty in these areas? Hmm. Hard to grab. It's flat. But yeah. No? No, sorry. Very orangey. Because That's a steep slope. Yeah. I don't think any of these are any good. Yeah, I don't think so. These buried ones are looking worse. Now I wish I took that first one. Uh, I don't remember where that was. Oh no, I meant like the first one from the other spot. Yeah. Get out of here? Yeah. Sorry, Michael. All right. Making you poke around at every rock. It's 
all Adam's fault. <laughs> What's that Just kidding. One? Did we let that one go? We must have. Those big ones down there? The big, the one yeah. On the this one? Slightly to the right, yeah. Is yeah, that one not huge? That's the, f that's the, that's first, the first one, one I think. picked up. Yeah, that was the best one, but anyway, it's not right, it's not right. Leave it? Yeah. Okay. Mass destruction. <laughs> Hmm. All right, come up on the winch bit there. It's hard on this wasted slope. If it's not like a little bit flatter, then everything's kind of just been buried. That's why it's sticking. You're there. looking for ones that are closer to the like Cl this, like, right? Yeah, where it looks like oh, it definitely it came like from off, that right? feature. Yeah. Any, mm, any of these? Are those loose? Or I don't know. Seems like the ones that were, I don't know, like some of that looks good maybe. It mm. seems like the ones that were on the, like that little plateau earlier were good because they weren't all covered in sediment yeah. and so they hadn't changed as much. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like a lot of this is buried. Well, it looks yeah. to be singular pieces, is actually just angular parts of the rock. Mm. Eh, no. Yeah, maybe. Maybe like that one. Mm. Have a look. Or Let's try over here. I don't know if he can set down, though. Let's try one more time for this one right there. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that's a nice sacco calyx. Yeah. I don't Say know. Wrong who, every time. I, I don't know that what I'm saying is right. But uh, I think you're right. It's probably calyx. I've given up. When you up. think of, like, you know, like Latin. But then again. You know, we're naming all of these As I'm now. Saying, <laughs> dead language. Calyx. According to Google. This one, this one or this one? Let's try the top one first. Calyx. Okay. Yep. Yeah, you got it. Oh, actually, in still cam, yeah, this one looks nice. Keep expecting in still cam that it's going to, like, also show my yellow line. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Pops up everywhere. And then viewers at home have literally no idea what we're pointing at. Yeah. <laughs> uh, which one were you after? This one? This one right there. Yeah, if anyone was uh, confused, we have like a little uh, thing we can draw on. You Foot can see in the Football telestrator. Yeah. And, um, but it doesn't project uh, the one onto, above the, that one. Okay. onto the live stream. So that's why you can't see us do our little Please yellow don't be lines. Attached. Oh, it's... Up, it can kind of spear. It's twice as big as we thought. Yeah, uh, <laughs> let's spin that. That one's probably good. Just Looks as good like as the first thing we found. Stuff on it. Oh. Wow. Yeah, it looks like a bigger version of the first one we picked up. Um, <laughs> Oops. What a. Okay, then yeah, that's a tentative. Okay. What? <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna that walk one? away with that or or some or something from here. Is is uh that one a little smaller maybe on the right? Which one? Uh, under the arm now over there. Okay. Uh, let's see. Isn't this so exciting? <laughs> and then rock, and then Adam's gonna rock cut it open and be down. like, yeah, it's this, and then put it away. <laughs> it's gonna be like garbage rock. <laughs> it's, it's a cool indicator that we're on the slope too. Right back over the edge. <laughs> Just kidding. Gravity works in the ocean too. These are all so buried. <laughs> yeah, that one's huge. <laughs> Man. Tough crowd. Oh. Another little one right next to it. Mm -hmm. I don't want to get any of the ones that are too flat. <clears throat> oh. It's oh. Big nugget. Yeah, the other one was better than that. Yeah. I don't like this one. 
I think I think I like the first one we picked up better. Let's just walk away with that one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Adam, I tried. I can't spend more than 20 minutes on this rock. I tried. Michael tried harder. All right. Uh, can we spin that one real quick oh, one more time? Yeah. Sorry, thank you. It's like a claw machine game when you don't quite get the one you want, but you spent too much money. Yeah, and you got something. <laughs> <so>. <laughs> sunken, <laughs> sunken cost fallacy. All right. That's, That's good. Thank you. thank you. Oh, what's the sample number? Uh, 123. Awesome. And, and you where would you like it? What's um, open over do there? Do you think it will fit an A? Or do you think it's a pretty big rock? Because it can go in A or E. A. Will it go in A? Ah, yeah, yeah, maybe. Nice. Oh, got it. Got it. Slant up. Good aim. Nice. All right. Okay. Uh, would you mind zooming out a little bit on high pack quick, Cheyenne? Please? Yes. See where we're at? How far are we to two? Uh, we are... Kind of get into the base of this slopey area. About 350. About 350? Yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. let's head straight for that. Let's mm -hmm. go point three if that's possible. Okay. Oh, oh uh, man. We... Just a fair warning, we will not be able to go this direction. Will not be able to? No. Unless it, Is the that coming from upstairs? Well, I'm just looking at the currents and winds so far. This is almost lateral. Um, can we, can we ask about that? We can, we can ask when we get up there. See, maybe the winds will be better but we'll probably not be able to move laterally. Okay. Trying to we think if I would like to change the course based on that. I mean, right now, <clears throat> the direction we're headed right now, the mm -hmm. same heading or bearing, uh, headed to two. I mean, if that works. Yeah, we can, we can go to two. Okay. We just won't be able to move, like, we just probably won't be able to move laterally across here. But if from two, we can work our way sort of like, yeah, there, yeah. then that, that's, that's okay. All right. So let's head to two first then, yeah. Or that general area. And we're moving. <laughs> we're not moving yet. <laughs> we're kind of moving. <laughs> <laughs> Something in the still cam, and it's gone. Zero, six, zero. I believe the last watch was doing point three. So we're going to, the ship is good to go 0.3 knots. Awesome. We're moving. <laughs> Actually. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Takes a little, a little time to swing it. <laughs> man. But um, good time to do introductions now. Yeah. Yeah. So welcome everybody to the 12 to 4 watch. I'm your SPL host, uh, Daniel. I'm the scientist, Sarah. I am Leela, the watch lead on this watch and science manager on the cruise. Oh, I'm sorry, I was yawning. <laughs> um, I am Loopy. I am the data logger for this um, cruise. Loopy with an I, by the way. Yes, Loopy with an I, and it's Loopy, not Lupe. Sorry, I've been I've been allowing y'all to say it wrong. 
<laughs> Why is it that you, so full name Guadalupe, mm -hmm. how'd you get the nickname Loopy? Okay, so I actually, because I'm named after my great-grandfather, uh -huh. and um, we have a cousin um, that he went by Lupe. Okay. Mm -hmm. So my mom was like, well, I wanted it to be different. Okay. So she was like, let's do Loopy and put Aww. an I instead. Oh, I like that. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> nice. Want to look at those corals or front row? Yeah, we can zoom on those corals while we do front row and shows. I am Sarah, uh, the Atalanta pilot. Uh, Michael, the Hercules pilot. Uh, Cheyenne, the navigator. And I'm Amber, the video engineer. Woohoo! Twelve to four. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. <laughs> Twelve to four. Um, actually, let's look here first, maybe. Look at the sponge. I know they've been seeing <sighs> mostly primnoids. Yeah, these, the, that looks like primnoids up there. Yeah. Go ahead and zoom. You know what we haven't been seeing? What? Uh, whale, whale sharks. Yeah, whale sharks. Man. <laughs> first one of the watch. Yeah. Um, um. Glass sponge? <laughs> <laughs> yes, certainly that. Uh, oh, this is that one that we were like, Hylanema? I think that's Hylanema. Yeah. That looks like Hylanema to me. That's good, thank I you. I agree. Get that stool girl uh. shot. <laughs> I keep forgetting well, I have probably the power. Pretty good. I, it was blown out. Oh, actually, it wasn't. I, I, uh, yeah, uh. that central thing is really doesn't tell you. Yeah. It used to be that much more. It's not Ooh. bad, actually. Yeah. That's a really, that's a dying primnoid next to it. Yeah, I would never drive off of that central image. Very misleading. There's a normal looking holothyroid. Uh, yeah. Took me a minute. <laughs> <laughs> but we're, we don't have to look at it. Oh, that one rock looks like a barnacle from afar. Is that a metallogorgia? No. That's no. a nope, that's just a weird angle on that per note. <laughs> It'd be fun if we saw one though. That'd be nice. Yeah, I hope uh Flying shrimp on the sea can't. I still can. Oh yeah. Big antenna shrimp. Is that that uh the um oof the one with the A. Not R. the huge one. Uh the with, the with the swimmer oars? No? No. <clears throat> this is the uh long actually. I think that's that I think that it one. is. You're right. It's uh our what was that? Artemia or I cannot remember that name right now. Can't quite see from these, but I think it is. Right? Looks like it. Aristeid. Aristeidy. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Could be. Yeah, it's that genus. Can't quite tell. At least that order. Order? For the shrimp? Yeah, I don't think I would call it the genus there. You sure? It looks. Yeah, it's uh, not really comprehensive, you know? Yeah. Hard to say that it's for sure. Dendrobanchiata? 
I don't know if that's the uh, order. No, just the, the Aristeidae. Oh, 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 oh. But oh, not oh. the Got genus yep. name. I went one up. But yeah, I've, I've heard that it this dive has kind of been less dense. Yeah, we're all which is now fine. we're getting up above two thousand. Yep. Which is where we've been seeing where we would more expect stuff. to see more. Yeah, based off of what we've seen so far on this cruise. Mm -hmm. Um and really probably picking up more after around eighteen hundred or so. Yeah. This is also quite the sandy slope. Mm-hmm. Some things on this rock coming up. And for those of you who are looking for the uh, depth and water temperature on the main page, it should be back up right now. A lot of these big red crinoids are so pretty. Yeah. Another sea cucumber. A sponge. Let's look at the sponge. Sure. This is it. Prosocrinus. Oh. That's what we had in the past called those prosocrinidae of some kind. Cool. Cool. Now the sponge. Loopy. Just as I was getting ready. Oh. Mm -hmm. Caught me just as I was getting ready. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Zoom. Look at this big tube. Yeah. Remember how to spell this one, Loopy? Think this one. Rigadrella. Uh, this is the what one? Rigadrella. Oh, we've seen this one before. Rigadrella. R E. Can I remember the name of it? No. R not right now. A <laughs> but D. Wow, it's Rigadrella. Oh, oh, oh. G A pretty. Thank uh, you. Go back. So is it hollow on the inside or is it um, something back, else? Back. Yeah, A. I want to say yes. E L L. -A. Uh, we can zoom out. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah it's, it's got this kind of like scaffolding structure on the outside. Yeah, because the inside is where they filter everything, and it all comes back out that way. Yeah. Good there? Yep. yep. Thank you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Or it is, isn't it? Oh, we're really rolling. Oh, another sea cucumber. A lot of sea cucumbers, this dive. That's the Hansenetheria one, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Next one of those really big ones we see, we should zoom on it. They said that they all kept rearing up and like Moving. spewing dirt. Oh. Wow. Spewing poo dirt. 
<laughs> uh oh. We're scaring them. I know one of them. It was just like flipping around and like just circling and really doing flips with them. <laughs> oh. Put that in the chat for you, Loopy. Yeah. Mm. Yep. Coming up. Wow. Well, Daniel, do we have any questions, Any, anything? Yeah, we have a good one. So when bringing samples up, do we have to work quickly with corals? With the temperature and pressure change during ascent, are they extremely stressed by the time we get them in hand? And does that affect our ability to study them? Uh, I missed this. Is what stressed by the time? By the time we bring them up? Uh, is this a bio? Uh, is bio stressed? With the temperature and pressure change during ascent, mm. are they extremely stressed by the time we get them in hand? Yeah, uh, the pressure change, not so much because they don't have gas-filled cavities in them um, in general. So they, they don't come up all uh, uh, exploded or anything. Yep. Um, but the temperature change definitely does really stress them out, and so we're not... Uh, we're not studying anything live in the lab when it gets up here. Uh, the the boxes generally do a good job. The bio boxes when they're when they're fully closed of keeping the water cold, but it's you know warms up quickly when it gets on deck and when we're um, yep. bringing everything in and out. We get it into the fridge as soon as we can, but stuff is usually not. Not, cold. not wiggling around anymore. No. Oh, you know what was wiggling around yesterday? Um, I think the Atlanticella sample. There. So, Brian noticed. Oh, the ophiroids. Was it an ophiroid? No. Oh. So, Brian, when Brian pulled out the tray, uh -huh. there was like a little black thing that was just like going everywhere uh -huh. <laughs> in the tray. Um, somehow still alive, and uh, we put it under a microscope, and I think it was a little copepod. Oh, mm. cool. but it was a really pretty Dark iridescent, like blue, purple, green wow. little thing. So we took that as a subsample. Planktonic crustacean. Mm -hmm. cool. um, but sometimes, uh, yeah, the ophiroids will be wiggling around sometimes, sometimes shrimp a little bit. Um, but yeah, unfortunately, they uh, don't fare well. We put them into ethanol to preserve them pretty, pretty quickly. Yep. Hmm. You looking for something that you see in still cam? I see a little something here, but I can't quite oh tell yeah, where it is. Teeny little stock. Yeah. I feel like oh, that I think it's so right at the hard. center, actually. Oh yeah. I think it's a dead thing, actually, but I guess we can take a quick look. Jellyfish. Little jelly. Hey. Oh. Is it another sea dandelion? It wasn't. I looked really hard, though. <laughs> I was, like, laser focused on this past. <laughs> looked real hard for, the, like, one second it was on. Go ahead and zoom. I feel like I have to use all my brain power when things like that happen. Yeah. Oh. A bamboo. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Mm-hmm. I you see, see the, the bands. You do? I think they're... Uh, oh, maybe I don't. It's hard to see, actually. Let's see if still cam can help us out here. Yeah, I don't know if that's a primnoid or... Yeah, actually, no, I don't see... No, I see the... See wait, the here, here, yeah, bands. There's a band. Yeah? I think there's a band. Okay. I think so. If you, it, if that's what you say, I'll believe you. <laughs> I don't know, and you still can't. It looks so primnoidy. I know, but the I'm the worst the at telling are, primnoid. The uh, worst. To me, the polyps look more bamboo, but that's what I thought about all the primnoids. I, oops. Oh, all right. All right, all right. that's good. We're good. Thank someone you. with someone, someone who's better at telling the difference will uh, Steve. sort that out later. Yep. Yeah. 
Yep. It's tough. Tough out here. Did I tell you we saw a relicanthid last night? Like that anemone with the really flowy. No, I love those. I know. I was really happy. Like oh, a different, a different cucumber. I know. I was very excited when we saw it because I initially thought it was a lipanema, and then I saw like the protrusion. That's really long and flowing. And I was yeah, like, oh my gosh, so and it's stalked. So, yeah. Very exciting. Oh, you know what? Uh, mm. Look, it's another sea cucumber. I think it is a primnoid, yeah. And that's what shore size suggesting as well. Ooh, we're really rocking now. Hmm? And then the ship rocking back and oh. forth. You also see yeah. on an Atlanta cam. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep, Primnoid. Unstalked Norella. Or, unbranched Norella. Unbranched Primnoid of some kind. I feel like it's so hard to tell. Yeah. What, which one. Hmm. Really interesting how there's really only yeah, there's Primnoids around one. here. Wonder what yeah. happened. Why are they so good at living in this area? There's a little sponge on the left corner. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, another Rigadrella. I said no to that one zoom of the fat cucumber and <laughs> you haven't gone. seen no another more. one. <laughs> I know, I'm I sorry, I let you I all down. I never saw a fat cucumber like that before. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it was really big. Even in the even when they like ejected themselves from the sediment, it still looks like huge, thick. I have a video of one of the cool ones rock. that the other watch had. Oh, the one that was like in the air. Yeah, we were like the one that was like around. flopping. Was yeah, that thing oh is like man, a man. That thing is weird. Like a pancake. It's huge. Was that the one that was on the, oh, like, was yeah, I think on the surface and then all of a sudden lifted up and started, like, rolling and, like, yes. doing yeah. tricks for him pretty much? <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Got some it great still camp shots. Well, we were sitting in the lounge and stuff, it was just rolling, doing tricks for us. Showing off cucumber. Yeah. <laughs> At first it rolled over us, so, like, it's yeah. back. And Adam was Can like, we oh, my silly rubs. Run down there. <laughs> and then... Oh, that's sure. just a bathy pathies. Yeah, I think it's bathy pathies. And I, that one probably is just another hylanema, but probably. yeah, I don't know. It's cute, though. Yeah, so many of the photos from uh, this expedition will be up on our website soon. Uh, we'll have many photo albums, including uh, many of the mm -hmm. creatures that we've been talking about, especially sea cucumbers. So look out for Go that ahead, soon. Go ahead, Zoom. Yeah, it's a little high oh, on yeah. That's all right there. We just saw one look just like this. Cool. That's good, thank good. you. Okay. Full wide. Do you want the coral? Um uh, thought it was yeah, quick we could do it yeah, quick, somewhere. yeah. We know what it is, but For might fun. as well take a quick look. For fun. Oh, Make it a mess. Gosh, Anna Bird. Yeah. Kicking the dust thing. up everywhere. Oh, Ooh, oh what is falling oh. down? Oh, wow. Yeah. Dead fish? It looks like a dead cuskeel or something. Yeah, I know. Man. Go ahead and zoom. That was. He's just dizzy. Ha <laughs> <Yeah>. Dead. <laughs> no, Humpty Dumpty lived in the He's deep not sea. He's not moving anymore. Yeah. yeah. Pretty. Can we maybe look at that thing that fell? <laughs> if we can see okay, it. Okay, yeah. full wide. And what Somewhere is this coral? Left. Left. That was a bathy pathies. Go I ahead, zoom. Somewhere in here, here. right? That yeah. less round thing right there. Oh. Some sort of skeleton. Oh my god, it looks mm. very strange. 
Looks like a golf Does ball. it not look like there are like two little beady eyes looking back yes. at us? Yeah. yeah. Looks <laughs> scary. What oh, is that? What is that? Some kind of shell? Sarah's is known for thinking what eyes. What is that thing? It's like That's a alive. That is alive. That it looks has like a, a shell. Pod. It's some kind of weird mollusk of some kind. A <laughs> what? Sample? Sample? Maybe? <laughs> yeah. Pick it up. We slurp it? <laughs> slurp it? Uh -huh. If you want to sample it, we're going to have to stop, stop and the come ship. back. We're really far behind okay, as we're it is. Okay, mm -hmm. that's all right. All right. Well, uh, all right. Okay. It looks like a shell. I wish we sometime. could make it move again. Man, it must have been on. Oh, oh there's a radio there. Saw it drift by. Wow, that was cool. Oh man, wow. that was cool. Wish we could. Wish we could. Could catch. Sample that. Well, well, you can stop the ship and come a, back. Yeah, it's you want a, it? I feel like that takes a long time now. It does. Yeah, <laughs> it's not. It's, right. it's okay. Maybe we'll see more. It'd be nice <laughs> to catch a video of that. Yeah, that was cool. And looked, and we could probably, and so if we look back at longer. video, we can see where. Like it, it was sticking something out, you know. There was some little. Yeah. I well, that's why we it. all thought it was a fish because it oh, it had right. like a head yeah, and like yeah, a long yeah, a yeah. tail. There was like a little yeah. sticking something so it's out. Like the sluggy part of it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. The foot <laughs> must, but it looks like a modified. Oh wait, foot. if we're behind, it's okay. Actually. Actually. Yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah, let's get ahead so that if there was another cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thing we can. Uh, up for it. Huh. I'm intrigued. Mollusk. Gastropod. Let's see. Perhaps this. See, actually. Oh yeah, that looks like it. What? Uh, we're just, just looking. Just IDing the, the snail. Oh, God. oh okay. That's it. Totally. Oh, it's so a long pretty. tail thing. What's it? It's Margarita D. <laughs> it's yeah. Margarita D. I could take it. I'll take that. I'll spell it. Okay, it's margarita and then D-A-E at the end. <laughs> Possible. There you go. Well, huh. look at that one. Man, that would have been cool to see it in action. Yeah. But cool nonetheless. Love when we have a gastropod moment. Don't get many of those. No, because they're so small. Why is that they would not find too many gastropods down here? Um, usually they're associated with other things. And if they're not, they're really hard to see. Like just on um, rock and sediment. That's really it. And they're kind of small, like all of them. So we've probably seen a lot and we just didn't see it, if that makes sense. That was just a really good example of one <laughs> Getting spooked. Want to make it as a comment or? Um, yeah, you could make it as a comment. Big swells. Hmm. Anything else going on, Daniel? Sorry to keep asking. I'm just so no. curious. Joke. Fine. Joke. Joke. Something. Joke, joke time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, jokes. Hmm. Well, People. I will say for those who are watching, you know, checking out our website, we do have a new blog up about World Ocean Day. Ooh. And we have stories from 
uh, people aboard the Nautilus about their uh, ocean exploration stories and how they got into being aboard the ship. So it's worth checking out. Look at that big sea big lily. Old crinoid. You know, just to go pass around the question of the day. Mm. So if you had to choose a sea creature to battle a Pokemon, which would it be? <laughs> I don't watch. I didn't watch Pokemon either. I can't answer this. You question. never played Pokemon? No. Or, or I was never I into it either. With oh wow. I didn't either, but I, I'd say anglerfish. Oh my gosh. Because they look yeah. wicked. All right. Well, yeah, anglerfish would be a great one to have play a Pokemon. Yeah. If you could, yeah, <laughs> if you could use any anyone to fight, I would say a king crab. Mm, could you put anglerfish and a king crab, you know, together? Well, that's See what happens. Easy. I feel like that's pretty easy. Hmm. Easy matchup. Oh, or what did that? Oh. Oh, we got a sea cucumber right in front of us. Maybe the sea cucumber? But that's a huge gust. Do what? That poop? Oh, this mess. We weren't up here. Yeah, that's weird. Or a landslide. Oh, Hmm. Maybe. Alright, we're gonna have to come up pretty quick here. Okay. Maybe the sea cucumber eviscerated. Or. I think that's the word for it. Lost its lunch. Yep. <laughs> I will put up a sea cucumber against a a sea star and see what happens mm. no uh, urchin yeah mm. well, I don't like this invertebrate fight pit <laughs> thing we're starting here see which will win the the well, squish or the spines well no. I feel like that's kind of I was easy. I was thinking more so of like a cus eel with a sea cucumber <laughs> or like an anemone yeah. Kind of like just like a gummy bear fight, essentially. <laughs> 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 It'd just be cute. <laughs> a gummy, gummy bear bit. fighting toothpicks. Oh man, I wish I didn't run out of gummy bears now that you I said that. I know, I just I was thinking yeah. the same. I've been out of my Sour Patch Kids for a week now. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's rough. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That sucks. <laughs> um, is that something? Can you maybe pan to the right a little bit? If you're able. Um, yeah, what's that? Yeah, it's kind of pinky. Mm -hmm. Skeleton of some sort, too. Sea star? Yeah. But how's it propped up like that? Eating something. Oh. Ooh, big guy. Big one. Oh, yeah, squishy. Hmm. Go ahead and zoom. Like I've been waiting. Oh, wow. oh very bulbous. <laughs> oh, it's, it's getting eating. Patrick. It's yeah. <laughs> it's just standing oh, it's up eating right? whatever stocked, like whatever coral's on. There's something to the left of it too. Um, 